Hello, hello, everyone. Welcome back to another episode hey. of Meta Monday. What's up, guys? It's Leon and Danny. Oh. Hi, hi, everyone. Welcome back to Meta Monday, a session whereby we update you every single thing under the sun about NFTs so you don't have to waste time on scoring Google or TikTok. Yep. <laughs> That's uh, a yeah. Yep. That's yeah, a very sure. good one. Let me uh just check as everything is fine. Okay. Okay, we're live. We're live on YouTube. Live on everywhere. For those of you who are streaming in, say hi. You know, say hi in the comments. And then I'll say hi to you back and spam the like button and show us some love for doing this live for you guys. Right? I mean the community is the one that keeps us doing the show anyway. Yeah, and I got yep. some good feedback. Yeah, like you know, there's uh I have this one feedback uh that said that they actually learned something through the to this to this talking session that we have. Yeah, so I was quite I was quite touched. Like thanks for tuning in, guys. Yeah. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for all of your support, guys. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. Uh okay then. I think we're good. We're good to go. Yeah. I, I'm, Really, we're really grateful for you to uh, join our live every Monday. Let's talk all about NFTs and Outland. And uh, this this week, we're going to bring up uh, the main topic for this week is uh, treasure hunting. But before we go to the main topic, let's uh, go to the N NFT weekly news. And I got some news here. It's it's actually very surprising. Uh, first up is the Japanese government is actually proposing to create an NFT task force. How amazing is that? Wow. So the Liberal Democratic Party, the LDP, launched an NFT policy task force uh, with the official name NFT Policy Review Project Team. Uh, this group is headed by the LDP MP Masaki Taira. Uh, it, it, was, it also was started by the former Minister of Digital Transformation, Takuya Hirai. So this is not a very sudden move, but they actually saw the potential of NFTs and the crypto space. So Japan is looking to enhance its movements to the upcoming space, as they actually have a white paper for this. Uh, uh, the, ta the task force member, Akihisa Siyozaki, uh, oh. said, that the country must drive innovation in the Web3 era. And they're giving this, uh, they, they actually do want to have a prime minister for Web3 because they yeah. feel that the government must consider the NFT sector as a new growth engine. And the paper also added they, they actually need uh, an NF, uh, Web3 related matters uh, minister. And, and that's just how NFT is now very widely accepted around the world even though it's just boom in 2021 but it has already made changes throughout a world politics okay for a second news it's uh nike is set to crack down on nft sneaker copycats i think uh <laughs> yeah nike has had enough with the copycats <laughs> with all of you yeah all you shit people <laughs> <laughs> they, just, <laughs> they just keep copying. That's why uh, NF, uh, Nike actually um, uh, acquired the RFT effect, R R R T F K S uh, studio to make their own uh, NFT studio, so they can yeah, they can promote their NFT space section. So uh, this, yeah. So <laughs> this Nike. Really funny. <laughs> Nike started started the. Uh, to crack down because of the infamous Nike and StockX uh, lawsuit. So the lawsuit between Nike and StockX is actually scaring off a lot of potential NFT producers. So what happened is StockX is a platform for you to uh, buy sneakers. Um, by, because there's a lot of sneakers head out there that got scammed. So StockX is there for you, for you to uh, buy, buy everything you need and it's legit. And then StockX had the idea of making an NFT for it, for its sneakers that they sell. So it's not their sneakers; it's Nike, the Puma, Adidas. Uh, they actually just made the NFT, 
like a barcode NFT, so people can uh, can know that it's legit and it's also a proof uh, a proof of certification that uh, they bought this uh, uh, this sneaker to the from uh, Stop X. And Nike just said that this is a fundamental misunderstanding of NFTs, and this they're just this. It's pretty funny. <laughs> okay. Uh, so third uh, news is Cardano, a uh, Cardano the coin, uh, Cardano NFTs, smart contracts, and DeFi projects see a huge rise in volume. And uh, for all of you out there who wants to find an alternative for Ethereum-based NFTs, I uh, think Cardano is one of the, the best alternatives that you, can, that you guys can get now. Because Cardano has crossed the 2,000 mark uh, for the number of smart contracts on the platform for the first time, and this actually comes after skeptics. Yeah, 2000s. Uh, 2000. That's pretty Sounds quite low. In my... Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's quite low, but it's a very big milestone. Mm. Uh, so this actually came after skeptics have criticized the network for its lower activity since the testnet upgrade. So they had a, an upgrade last year and the activities just went downhill from there. And um, the change DeFi, but the change DeFi activity has seen a massive increase in March, increasing 39,000%. So this hard port uh, is expected to improve transactions uh, throughput on the platform and increase liquidity and volume. So mm. I think uh, that's a good enough reason for you guys, uh, for you guys NFT creators to move to Cardano. But one of the uh, person to pump the coin and from and show uh, the platform is also Snoop Dogg. So last week I actually I, I also did a bit about Snoop Dogg, even though Snoop Dogg blatantly confessed that he does not know anything about crypto with three or the NFT space. He is very active and a very prominent figure in our space. So Snoop Dogg recently announced a collaboration with Cardano NFT project uh, titled Playmates. So it's it's a play version of themselves. Um, this comes after he's been extremely bullish on the NFT and metaverse space as a whole. And he had particular focus on Ethereum based projects. So there, so his project is always in always uh, Ethereum based. And always in sandbox and Snoop Dogg actually made a music video uh, a music video in in the uh, in the metaverse so uh, this is a new news I think he just uh, published it yesterday or today but he uh, he actually published it okay uh, for the last news is Azuki NFT floor price rises and other blue chip NFT owners as why. Uh, this this is a very surprising uh, phenomenon because Azuki uh, they they have a lot of skeptics because it's uh, fairly it's not fairly old but it's been out there for quite a time quite a while and Azuki had had and also have a a, a downward trend. So at 30 ETH, Azuki is now at, at 30 ETH, and the floor shows no sign of slowing down. Well, this is a good news for Azuki holders, but uh, generally the NFT, the NFT space doesn't like it, and they don't know what's happening, either do I. Because, uh, because Azuki, uh, the NFT project actually recently uh, airdropped uh, piles of dirt so they so they made piles of dirt as an nft and airdropped them to all of its old holders and now the piles of dirt is actually doing better uh compared to something official that is uh an nft collection in in the full price of 10.2 eth so the piles of dirt is more expensive than 10.2 eth and all things considered azuki nfts it's now well positioned to get several blue chip projects for a run and it will be an interesting project to see and uh, how the other project will make the move so we, so the nft space 
but we have like six NFT blue chip projects now. And you know, let's just see how uh, Board API Octopus react because Board API Octopus actually had, uh, they had a hack in their Discord server. So they need to appease their uh, members. And yeah, so that's all for the NFT news for this week. And let's get to the main uh, topic, the upland, how to become an, an expert treasure hunter and, and make uh, billions of UPX in passive income. Take it away, Leon. Yeah, before that, I would like to say hi to Lev, Rahman, Andre, Rachel, Kevin, everyone that say hello to us. Hi, ladies and gentlemen, right? Spam the like button, right? Just whack the like, like button like how I'm whacking now. And you can see it up here. Yeah. Yeah, I think today is quite interesting, right? Uh, we're going to do this treasure hunt thing. Yeah, I'm not the expert in treasure hunt. I just treasure hunt once in a while. So I think my friend Patrick, he's in the community. You can feel free to find him. Patrick Ekabus, right? He's like the expert. He literally does that almost every day. I think every day a few times as well. Yeah, so he's he's really the master, right? I'm just a disciple of him. I don't really treasure hunt a lot. I just know the I just know some life hacks and what you need to do to prepare for the treasure hunt, right? Yeah, and I think today we are gonna be doing something very interesting as well. We're gonna do our first A to Z, A to Z, right? Mm -hmm. Auction to zero. Yeah, so I you know uh in the past week, right? So what I did is I just went to the community. I think some of you guys will probably have seen, right? Then I just low bought myself. I say that I'll put a property out there. Okay, give it a price. I don't know, like $50 or something. And then uh, for every one hour that nobody's buying, I'll drop the price by $2. It keeps dropping. Until to apply yeah, my I buy. I, yeah, I self low bought, man. Like, I think someone bought it for a really good deal, like $20 or something. Yeah. So I think if no one buys, then, you know, I'll end up lowering the price till it's $1 or something. I'm not trying zero. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but it's good for the person, right? I mean, they all we just want to make a friendly community. Yeah, it's all about the community here. Uh, we do this, uh, these crazy things just for you, the the community to scale better because this is upland pros, the best group to scale. <laughs> yeah, man. I mean, we want to share this opportunity. I think we want to be the most well known channel for being like the community driven thing, not like some other aggressive channels, right? Right. Yeah, so I think there's some stuff that we gotta do that you know. Uh, I would say it's not so much of losing money, but sharing sharing the sharing the pie with everyone. Yeah, yeah so I want to start off right by doing the first A to Z live over here because I think we have uh, one of the community members. What's his name? I think Matthew should be tuning in as well. It's afternoon for Matthew. Yeah. Hey, Matthew. Probably probably think lunch or something. Yeah. But anyway, he said he'll be on later and. Uh, yeah, I think he will be interested in buying some low vault or cheap stuff. We're gonna nice. share screen and then yeah, I think we're gonna start, man. We're gonna start with the A to Z, right? And if you guys want to say hi to Joanne, just hi, say Joanne. wanna say hi to Joanne. Yeah. Yeah, hi Joanne. Nice. Nice to meet you. Hey, can you all see my screen? Oh, why am I sharing yep. this? Oh. Okay, let me share just the thing itself. Right. Share screen, share Chrome tab. Share... Hi to Henry. What's up, man? Henry, Henry, hi, hi, Henry. What's up, guys? Spam the like button, right? I'll say hi to you. I'll tell you what, if you drop your username inside, I'll give you free UPX or so. How's that? I'll like send oh, my nice. little, I'll send you my little squirrel. If you're in if you're in LA, right? I'll do an LA drop for you live on this this uh Mana Monday. Right? I'll visit your place and I'll give you like 50 UPX. You can send it to the max 150 UPX. I'll just give it to you, no problem. Yeah, but you gotta be in lot, you gotta be in LA because I can't fly over to any other places, it'll take some time. Yeah, so if you're in LA, right, I'll give you the, the the free UPX, whatever that you want, right? Yeah. TikTok land, is that you? TikTok land, yeah. that's love. Hmm. Yeah, so I will start off the day by auctioning one of the Fresno properties, the properties in Fresno, can you all see? F-R-E-S-N-O. This one, it's a house. I put it on sale for $65, right? This is real, guys. This is totally 100% real. It's real right, Danny. You can see it live, right? Right, yeah. It's a... Yeah, so I bought this for $62,000, oh, right? $62, okay? I'm going to I'm gonna try to lowball myself and see how, how it goes, right? So for every, you know, how about we do this? Every 10 minutes that no one is buying, I'll drop the price by, let's say, $5, $2, okay? 
two dollars. Whichever that works, yeah. We just drop it. Sell it for some USD. See, so I'm gonna I'm gonna start the sale price by selling it at below of what I bought also. Okay, let's do it. So I bought it at like 62, right? And I'm low-balling myself now to 50, just because we want to we want to share the pie with everyone, right? I hope the noobs actually buy those, especially those who just probably started out. Yeah, you know, you 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 want a property that is built on your land, right? Yeah, so I got a shortcut for you, just buy off the shelf. <laughs> yeah, you can snipe. Okay, so we just leave it here for a while. Five eight two zero North Sherman Avenue. I think uh, Danny can help me to type in the in the chat or something. This address, okay. so people, yeah, so they can they can they can buy and then we know we put a dash and put fifty dollars or something. Yeah. Okay, let me wait up five. Yeah, that's the way. Somebody's spamming the like button. That is the way, man. What's up, guys? What's up, guys? Yeah. Five so I think we're gonna do yeah we're gonna do some crazy stuff. Danny is uh helping to put this property inside the chat, right? And then we will just keep lowering the price, right? Over over this uh, Meta Monday live. Oh, right? thank you, Brian. <laughs> Brian is... Yes. Uh, Brian just uh, beat me to it for the five to, five to 80, five to 80. $5 for 10 minutes, lah. Uh, okay, sure, why not, right? Why not? I'll just set the alarm. So every five, every 10 minutes, we'll just lower the price down by $5. Just to, just to you know, have some fun, right? Okay, let's set a timer. So it's not probably like four minutes. Okay, so it's live. Huh? I put that four minutes timer, right? So you can see. Okay. Now I'll put yeah. it up. I'll put it up here. I'll put the oh, okay. on. Okay. That's great. So that is the address. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want some cheap stuff today, you can just snipe that property. I mean, it's really up to you. I bought it at 62. And you know it's a house, right? So it's worth more anyway, right? And hopefully you can share this uh, amazing channel with everyone or so. So they'll come in and... You know, share some of the pie, man. The pie is big, right? I've got quite some properties, don't worry. I got 50,000 worth of properties, so I can keep doing this for quite some time. <laughs> you don't have to worry that someone else will snipe you. Yeah, we got we got some properties to yeah to keep going. Yeah. Right here, right here. Okay. Then for now, let us start off with the treasure hunt, right? Okay, treasure hunt. Okay, so treasure hunt, I mean just a brief intro, right? I'll do some intro first. It's a, it's a very interesting component whereby you can either get some sparks, which you can build property from, or you can rent it, right? Or you can get some UPX or so. Right. You know, you get UPX for for, uh, for for doing treasure hunts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the best part is it's free to start off, right? You can spawn for free. I mean, even if you charge me some money for doing treasure hunt, I don't mind because you can get some rewards, right? Yeah, so that's the good thing. Yeah, the bad thing is... It's quite difficult to do. <laughs> you don't win hundred percent of the time. Yeah. Oh, before that, for the NFT sure. culture uh, audience, uh, can you explain to us uh, what is sport? What is what? Sorry. What is sport? What's the purpose? Yeah, what's the purpose of sport? Yeah, I mean the the purpose of uh, treasure hunting is either you get you mean the purpose of treasure hunting, right? Oh no, uh, sparks, sparks. Oh, sparks. Okay. Yeah. yeah, so Sparks is this one. See my screen, right? You get this Sparks thing here. You can stake it on uh, your... You can stake it on the property. Right. I mean, you can stake it to build houses, right? Sparks is a currency that you, you use in the game. Yeah. So over here, my Sparks is being staked into a couple of places. Yeah, like for example, like we want to build a house. Right, there you go. So it's in progress. Uh, all these are houses that are being built. You can see over here. Oh, wow. yeah, so, yeah, so you have to stake this... You have to like put your sparks into the area. You can stick your sparks. Yeah. And the more you stick, the lesser the construction time. If not, it will take like very long, right? You see, it takes 380 days. Like crazy, right? Yeah. So yeah. if you throw in a lot of sparks, right? Then it will decrease by, yeah. It will decrease by a lot. Because yeah, you just need to fill up your spark hours. Yeah. So, so one of the things that I've been doing for the past week, so I rented six of my sparks, right? Because I got six over here. Okay. Let me see. Let me show you guys. Okay, so I got six over here, right? Six point zero five. Yeah, so I rented these six out to to a gentleman. Yep. Then built built the I having to build his house. Yeah. So he paid me like one dollar a day for one spark. So like I charge him a discount. So it's like five fifty a day USD. <laughs> That's passive income. <laughs> yeah. Putting my sparks to good use. Right. Yeah. Do, do oh, they and, transfer you the money? Yeah, they transfer. They 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 do transfer me the money. Yeah. So you usually people charge like either uh, USD or UPX in the game as well. Both is fine. Oh, yeah. okay, okay. 
Yeah, so it's quite cool. And I think the property has been built finished because the my the sparks came back to me already. So I got six available. Yeah. So anyone want to rent sparks, let me know in the comments or so. <laughs> I'll charge you one USD a day, the standard rate. Yeah, if you need to build houses, right? Like this house, this beautiful house, then yeah, you have to use sparks anyway. Yeah, so you some so some people they rent and then they they try to sell the house after they build, right? And they make money. So that's how they do it also. Yeah. So it's okay, quite cool. okay, nice. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So one way to get sparks yep, is to oh, that is the alarm. So let's <laughs> do what we promised. We're gonna drop the price by five dollars. <laughs> Dropping the price with five dollars right now. Oh, nice. Yes, yes, yes. You're gonna drop. You're gonna go crazy, man. That's how we do it. All right, we're gonna drop by five dollars. Five forty-five. Yeah. This is your doing, Andre. Yeah, I'm doing it live for everyone. Huh? you can see over here, one hundred percent real, right? And uh, it's not like you know, one of us is one of our community members going to buy or something. No, it's it's just open to the public, right? It's for anyone that's watching this. Yeah, there's no hidden hack. Yep. Yeah. Just, if anyone gets the money, just go buy that property. 5280 and Sherman A Avenue. I mean I'm selling at, at a low ball price, right? I'm low balling myself. I bought it at like <laughs> I bought it at 62 and I'm selling at 45. But you know what? Who cares, right? So long as people are, are happy, right? The community. Yeah, share yep. the pie, ladies and gentlemen. Share the pie. Yeah. Share the pie. And that's how you play the upland game because it's a community game, not an individual game. Yeah, man. Yeah, you need to show some love to the community, right? So you gotta you gotta do stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so treasure hunt, right? Okay. Let's see. So what we do is basically uh this special little treasure will be somewhere in the map, right? So what you have to do is just keep hunting, right? Just keep taking areas and try to find where the actual treasures are. It's as simple as that, right? So the concept is simple, it's damn hard to execute, right? So I'm gonna do it live now over here. Right. Okay. But before that, uh, I want to let everyone know that you must stock up your sense first, right? S E N D S. Okay. That's my squirrel. Get my squirrel first. Yeah. So if your sense are very low over here, your see I got eleven cents, right? S E N D S. Yeah. If you if you are low on this, right, then you gotta pick up all the little the the little like paper aeroplane thing, because those are the ones that will give you the ammo to go hunting, right? If you don't have enough. 11 is probably the max that you can store. Yeah, if you got like one or two, then most likely you you won't have enough to do treasure hunt. Yeah, so the first rule is always stock up your sense, right? Yeah. Stock up your sense. Stock up your sense, man. Yeah, I'm trying to find some sense that they are just random uh paper plane looking thing that will, will just pop up. Then you then you just have to go there and pick it up. Yeah, let me see whether there's any around. <clears throat> Usually that's how we find sense, you just randomly scroll. Until a paper aeroplane comes up. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> oh, here you go. You can see. Yeah, there's two here. Yeah. So what people do usually is you send your little squirrel here. I mean your block explorer. Send it here. And then he flies there. Right. And then you pick up the sand. Yeah. Because every time you send your block explorer to somewhere else, you use up one cent. Yeah, so this is it. There you go. Yeah, simple as that. Yeah. So I already maxed out my cents for today. I mean, for, for, for quite a bit. Yeah, so I already got 11. So no point sending here, right? And every time you send, don't forget you have to pay the rent, right? For, for another person, you got to pay this amount to that person. Yeah. Okay, but anyone over here is in LA. If you are, drop your address, right? And I'll just send my squirrel to you. And then I will give you your visit fee for 50 UPX or 125 up to you to set. It's free money. Come and take it, ladies and gentlemen. That's how we do it. Yeah. That's free money, guys. Oh, man. It's free money, man. Just, just, just take it, man. Just take it and go, man. Take the money and go. Okay, that's how it works. Yeah. Okay, we got one minute and 55 seconds to the next uh, price drop. Right? So right after the next price drop, we will do, you know, the, the treasure hunting live in this channel. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, so now it's about one minute and 44 seconds. Yeah, I think that's quite a useful tool, right? You can share this tab. Yeah. So it's upxland.me, right? So this one, you can go to this feature, put find my send, type your username. So this will help you to identify the little arrows quicker, right? Yeah. So they'll tell you, like, for example, uh, 
there you go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So this one is a bit buggy, right? So sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. Yeah. So apparently, you know, they'll tell you like the distance from let's say wherever that you are. Yeah. Then you can find this this thing here. So you have to scroll one by one. Yeah, this is a little tool that uh somebody built. Yeah, but I'm pretty old school. Like, anyway, I'll just like, scroll one by one, just try to find these things. Yeah. But if you want a shortcut, you can use this tool, right? It's quite useful. Yeah, then you can click this, you'll copy straight away. And then you click and copy the address. Then you open it up. You can go to the whatever place. This is all your properties anyway. Yeah, mm. so you can, when you send yourself to the property, it's free, right? Yeah, I see. So I don't have to pay myself a toll. This is my property owned by me. Yeah, so I don't have to pay myself 50 UPX. That's quite, that's quite lame, right? Yeah, so that's how you do it. Yeah. Uh, Tolpat asks, uh, which city are you uh, are you in now? I'm in LA. LA. He's in LA. Yeah, LA. Yeah, you can see my... Yeah, so for example, if I send my squirrel here, send it back. Yep. Oh, it's 12 seconds, 11 seconds. See this? Nice. Seven more seconds to the next drop. Dropping? Yeah. Dropping. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nice. yeah. Five minutes again, okay? For now. <laughs> wow, this is some insane stuff, man. This is some money losing uh Meta Monday. <laughs> <laughs> You're losing money and giving it away. I lost your game, ladies and gentlemen. Tune in to a Meta Monday, right? <laughs> you can see my screen. So we're going back to the same house and lowering it by five dollars until someone decides to just snipe it off the market. Okay, so it's going for 40 now. Oh, 40. Yeah. yeah, it's dropping it below the buy price, right? Just keep doing it that way. Okay, and now I'm going to run the treasure hunt live in front of everyone. Treasure hunt takes probably, I don't know, two to five minutes or something. Yeah, so we can do it. We can, we can do one before the next price drops. Right, this is like some, you know, speed run kind of thing. Yeah, it's very fast. A to Z, it's very fast, guys. You got, you guys, to Go to a five to two eighty and Sherman Avenue and just buy that, buy that yeah, junk. Just, yeah, buy the junk, man. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's the way. It buy it because it's underpriced, right? I mean, it's a yeah, yeah. it's an underpriced property. Yeah, so you hold it good for you. You can, I mean, you can buy and flip it for like I don't know, like at the original price that I bought. Up to you. Okay, so over here, please confirm you wish to spawn a treasure hunt for free. So this is the potential UPX that you can win, right? You can spawn for free. You can go and do the treasure hunting. Okay, so I will use the treasure hunt as an explanation, right? Okay, so what you want to do oh. is you start somewhere. Yes. Joanne asks, uh, what's what's the send website again? She didn't uh, she didn't catch it. The, the what website, sorry? Uh the tool that you use. Oh upxland.me. This one. Oh you can't see upxland.me. Yeah, upxland.me. Okay, I started my, my treasure hunting already. So, I, so this is how we do it, right? We need to on the treasure hunt feature here. You can follow my mouse. You can see the screen, yeah. So this one is pointing upwards. You can see over here, right? Yeah, right. it's pointing upwards. Yeah, it means the treasure is somewhere there, okay? And once you trigger this treasure on, you can see the, the arrow pointing there. Yeah, so you probably want to zoom out and then you try to like go somewhere above that. You have your property, so you don't have to spend any UPX, right? So for example, I come to this area, open it up, send my screw here for free, right? Confirm, go. Go screw your damn it. Nice. <laughs> yeah, and you see this. I only have four minutes, right? You see this blue color one? You see three minutes and 55 seconds on the right side. Yeah. All oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, the blue one. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. You see, so so you see, oh, it's it's blinking a bit more, right? That means it's it's getting closer. So you must faster and faster, right? You zoom out and then you try to go up, keep going up, keep going up, keep going up, go somewhere here. Yeah, like this is how you do it, right? You try to zoom up, right? Find some property. Do I have any here? Do I have any here? No, yes, no, yes. Okay, sure. Maybe it's here. Yeah, you try to find the blue ones that you have, right? So you don't have to pay money. And then you use sense, S E N D S. Okay, this one, go send, send the screw up. That's how you do it, man. Go squirrel. No, we're treasure hunting, you see? Zoom in and out of the map. That's how you do it. <laughs> With tons of focus, ladies and gentlemen. You can feel the tension, man. Three minutes and 14 seconds. Happy. Yeah. There's a lot going on right now. <laughs> yeah, man. It's a, we've got a timer at the back for A to, a to Z or so. Okay, so it's this direction, right? You see? So I'm, I overshot that. So it's probably around here. So first of all, you do is zoom out again. Then you put a scroll, 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 find some property. <laughs> right? Shit, I don't, have any, I don't have any blue ones over here. Okay, uh, let's see. Okay, I got one here. Okay, so let's open this up. Let's zoom in again, and then we go. Right? So I got 2 minutes and 48 seconds full of tension. 
Okay, then you go move it, move it, move it, move the damn screw. Come on. Yeah. Okay, zoom in straight away. You click on it, so it opens up. Then it shows you the direction button. Okay, so it's somewhere there, right? So it's getting a bit closer, right? So it's blinking a bit more than just now. It says somewhere oh. above there. Wow, damn it! It's like taking me all over the map. Okay, let's see where can I go? Where can I go? Where can I go? Where can I go? Is this place available? Hollywood Hills. Okay, let me try. Let's say I try this area first. Okay, I got two minutes. Two minutes. Two minutes. It's like mission yeah. impossible. Okay, treasure. Oh, range. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. No. Yeah. I think I, I went a bit too far. <laughs> anyway, that's how you do treasure hunting. It's like damn stressful. <laughs> it's very yeah. stressful. Yeah, Wait. you try to like... Yeah, okay. I, I, I'll do one example, right? Of, let's say... Okay, for example, you don't have a property there, but your but your your Okay, back to the squirrel. Okay, for example, I need to look. Yeah. Okay, so the direction is this which way up, diagonal left up, right? And you can see that diagonal left up, I don't have any properties, right? So mm. I, I probably got to use my spans, my S P N D S, uh, my sense. Right. Okay, that is the next one. Please remind me later. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. yeah so I will send to other people's uh area right you see i have to spend a cent now i have to confirm and to spend one cent and 30 upx to send my squirrel to don't know who's uh place over here and i got one minute left only <laughs> so many things going on right yeah and then i dare faster open up right faster open up the damn thing yeah that's how you do it right treasure hunt life oh it's somewhere there oh Ooh. it's getting closer so it's no, i can't i can't okay so i don't know let's find over here 49 seconds so it's between Beautiful. the two pieces right yeah so i'm not i need to Send here. Oh shit, this guy charging me so much UPX. <laughs> 25. <laughs> yeah. That's how you that's how you lose money, man. Just <laughs> yeah. sending your box for Yeah. I got 30 seconds, you see. Oh, it's getting closer. It's getting closer. It's like blinking more and more. Okay, maybe it's here. Maybe it's here. So you could be sending over here. This is probably my last chance really. And then you expire. Wow. 19 seconds. 18 seconds, 17 seconds. Come on. <laughs> 13 it's seconds like oh crap oh, oh sh it's red color it's like nearby okay it may be this one it may be this one it may be this one is it ah, i think i'm dead is it is it time's up oh time's up oh man oh man oh, oh, oh. Spot. oh man yeah that's it man you see that's how you lose money ladies and gentlemen <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so but essentially, in fun way. yeah. So you you guys get how how it's being played, right? Yeah. So essentially, that's what you do. You try to like figure out based on the arrow, here and there. Yeah. So I think Patrick is really good. It, it takes practice, right? So he has this like mental chart. He was saying right that he like try to imagine, you know, <laughs> like like for example, if he points this way, then he try to imagine there's this like cone. Yeah. And then he was, he was okay. yeah then he was send his block explorer down here and then so like there's two cones intersecting for example yeah they try to think of it as an area yeah so i guess it takes practice to be good at it but that's the concept and if you're lucky you get <laughs> sparks right yeah so that's even better okay but anyway so let's do the let's do something let's do let's go back to a to z for now and then we'll run another treasure hunt it's quite fun a to Z. Oh, someone asked, can we promote uh, our props? Yes, you, you guys can promote your props in your in our pitch. Your uh, pitch your pitch prop your property. Yeah, yes, pitch your man. property. Yeah, I got yeah, pitch your property, man. See, ladies and gentlemen, that's how you do. It. You gotta pitch your property. Tell me why it's great, right? You can even offer value like this, right? You can lowball yourself. Like now, it's almost half the price, really. Yeah. I'm giving a, a, a good example of how to do pitch your property, right? By lowballing myself. That's how you pitch it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now it's 35, right? We started out with 62. Yeah. I think I'll keep going lower and lower nice. and lower. Until, yeah, I don't know, man. If you reach just $5, then great for that person. Right? Or you can snipe it along the way if you want. Anyway, this $35 is already way underpriced, right? It's really way underpriced. Okay? So we just keep it as this. So then, should we run another treasure hunt run? Yeah, sure, man. It's it, there's a lot of things going on. I didn't even know. Yeah, it's like insane stuff, right? Yeah. yeah. 
Okay, so okay, but remember the tip, right? The tip is we have to load up on the sends first because you've got to send it to other people. Yeah, so how many do I, I got seven now? Yep, I like to usually load it up till the maximum. Right, so I will try to find more of that little arrow thing also in the meantime. All right. Mm -mm. So I use that tool going back here. Over here, I found it. Oh. Yeah. I was using that UPX, UPX land.me. Yeah. Send the screw down. Yeah. So for me, I, I like to treasure hunt in uh, LA really because you see, I got, I got quite a lot of properties here, right? So the more you have in one map, like you try to scatter it over in the different places, then you don't have to waste so much UPX. Yeah, because you have to send to other people, right? Yeah, so you waste send, waste UPX. So you spread it around the map, chances are you can like point your block explorer for free. Like just now I used, how many I used? Four? Yeah, if you don't have many properties, you probably have to use like 11 each time <laughs> just to get there. Yeah, yeah. Right. Okay, let's see whether I got any more other sends. You know, I can just start. I don't think I need so many also. I hope I don't need so many. <laughs> Yeah. So if you're an expert like Patrick, you can get it in five tries, man. You send it to five places, he gets it. Five yeah. tries? Only? Yeah, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, he, if I'm not wrong, he told me once he got it like in, like he got so lucky that I think within a second one, he already got it. He sent one and then he move out and then click and then, okay, there you go. <laughs> yeah. Nice. yeah. Oh, oh, nice for video. the NFT culture folks, uh, how much sure. how much UPX uh, do you get for treasure hunting? Oh, you get anywhere from... Just not that amount, I think a few hundred to, oh, I got four cents, even better. Easier for me. Nice. Yeah, I maxed out already. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah. So the reward is anywhere from, okay, let's see. A uh, few hundred to a few thousand. And you can even get the, you can get sparks also. Nice. Okay, okay. Here you go. Yeah, you can get 290 to 8,250. 8,000 is $8. You can potentially get eight dollars just to treasure hunt, guys. Yeah, or you can lose eight dollars also, like me. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about yeah. that. Yeah, right. Yeah, but I'll say it's it's worth uh honing your skills, right? Because eight dollars, I mean if you can use the eight thousand UPX, you buy a property that's let's say eight K and you sell it for like four dollars and you still make four dollars for less than one hour of your time. Nice. Yeah, you know, like this little things make sense, right? It's just and it's fun, right? That's the most important thing. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's do it. 125. I paid 125 UPX. And in my life, in my life. Yes, I got five minutes. You see the blue color clock, right? Okay, faster click. Yeah, yeah. On the treasure. Okay, it's quite far, right? You can see over here. Okay, so I want to zoom out quickly. Since it's so far, I want to bring my screw all the way here first. Okay, maybe I'll try the extreme, maybe here. I love these properties here. These are huge properties, right? Bought it for a lot of money. Nice. Bought this one for seven hundred dollars. You see, seven hundred USD, man, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, so yeah, I got three over here. <laughs> You're definitely not gonna sell that. Yeah, I mean, this Beverly Park Lane is the really where all the celebrities live as well. Live as well. Yeah. So why not? Yeah. Okay. Wow, well, we're still showing up, man. It's like way higher. Wow. I really thought I moved so far, right? Okay, let's see whether we can go any higher than that. Do I have any blue property? Oh, I do. Oh my god. Okay, let's see whether I can bring here. Okay, oh, zoom in sorry, to Ralph's. Yeah. For as yep. nice, for as nice, uh, she uh, uh, she or he asked, what's the tool you're using to find sense? Uh, that's UPX land. Land dot me. Dot. Yep. UPX land dot me. Click the thing on the left side, the tab, then go to find my sense. Yeah, let's see. Okay, it's pointing me upwards. Diagonal left up. Okay, diagonal left up. Okay, I, I don't know. I feel more confident this time, man. Oh, maybe it's here. Maybe it's oh, around here. Do it. Okay, let's see. Let's zoom in. Oh, I have a super king. Cool. Whatever this is. Quickly send my squirrel. You see, so far, I've not used any sand. I haven't paid anyone any UPX, right? I think that's the benefit of owning properties like in a sparse like a area. Yeah, like only in different areas. It's good for treasure hunting. Okay, it's somewhere down there. Somewhere down there. So, but it's quite far though. Where is it? Is it? Am I going back? Okay. Do I have any blue ones? If not, I will. If not, 
I will, hey, why is there no property here? Okay, I'll just randomly send to one. So at least I can see where I am. Move the squirrel. I've got two minutes and I'm not even close. <laughs> yeah, by this, yeah, by this timing, it should be like close to red really. If not, yeah, I'm quite stuck. Yeah. That's the bridge you have to say guys for UPX. Yeah, oh, I just don't need to you're getting close. You're getting a bit closer. It's blinking, right? Okay, so I want to bring it here. Zoom out a little bit. I'm trying to figure out where do I have blue property. Okay, I got one here. Okay, oh, send nice. it here first. Send for free. So I'm not paying. I want random one here. Is it is it is it they are buy this to pitch your property? <laughs> it's a random property here. Click it. And let's see. Okay, I think uh, somewhere in the middle. I think somewhere in the middle, like between the area and th this area, right? So I'll try this place. I've got one minute and 50 seconds. I'm not going to give up. I'm going to fight. Fight like a warrior, like a real treasure hunter, like a bounty hunter in Alita. <laughs> <laughs> like you're in the Amazon. Yeah, man. Okay, over here, you click it. Oh, 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 it's blinking, it's blinking, right? It's blinking more. Oh, it's blinking. Damn it, okay, okay, wait, huh? okay, So I need to zoom out. I got one minute and 20, 30 seconds. Okay, I'll just randomly whack something over here. Okay, just randomly whack. Come on, come on, faster. We look so slow, scam. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the game looks slow, then you say scam. Right. Okay, okay, one minute, one minute. How many everyone? Oh, there's some sands over here. Click on it. Ah, what am I doing? Oh shit, where's my... Ah, why can't I get... Oh, it's blinking, blinking, oh. blinking. It's like blinking, blinking, blinking. Okay, maybe it's here, maybe it's here. I got 43 seconds. Probably I got like two more tries and then time's up really. Come on, load, damn it. <laughs> I am very immersed in just seeing you Attempt to treasure hunt. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm treasure hunting live, man. This is a very stressful activity. So, yeah. so stressful. Takes... It's like you're lost in an IKEA showroom. Yeah. It takes tons of practice. Oh my goodness, it's red. It's red. I got 19 seconds, but it's very close. Maybe it's here. I got one more try. I got one more try. Let's go. I got one more freaking try. See, it always happens like this, man. Give me the last one, and then it becomes red color. Yeah. <laughs> quick, 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 quick. Quick, 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 damn it. Quick. Hello. Oh, I lost it. All treasure. Yeah, oh, lost man. it, lost it. Yeah, that, that's how treasure hunt works, right? It's a money sucker, <laughs> money black hole. <laughs> the game takes a lot to load too. I think that's yeah. one of the strategies that the game plays on you. Yeah, it, it just makes the load time quite bad, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, oh. wait. It's not end. It's, it's not ended because I'm going back to the property. Five eight two zero North Sherman Avenue, right? Yes, five two eighty North Sherman Avenue. Great. I shall go back. My screen is still alive, right? Okay. What's the price now, man? What's the price now? I think it's thirty. Thirty. Okay, let's do it, man. Thirty. Let's let's go crazy and put it at twenty eight. 28 you oh, okay less than half less than half ladies and gentlemen live on meta monday that's how you do it man that's how you share the pie with the community Damn. yeah oh. crazy man if you reach us one dollar then you know there's only three words so be it <laughs> okay let's do pitch your property danny any any pitch your property now okay oh hello Aldrich Obak, that's a new new guy has come. Okay, let's do, let's go. So pitch your property live where you got junk and we got UPX. I mean, Leon got UPX. I mean, I'm just seeing your junk. So first up, <laughs> first up, first up is uh, Lev Rah Rahman. Yes. Okay, here you go, 3739. Belvedere Street, Detroit. Okay, three seven nine. Oh, it's another Detroit. 
There's a lot of junk in Detroit, man. Yeah. <laughs> what happened in Detroit, guys? Uh, I don't know, man. What's going on there? B-E-L-V-E? B-E? B-E-L-V-E? Oh, I can't find your junk. Okay, let me zoom out the whole map what? first. A bit laggy today. Maybe they know I'm treasure hunting. That's why they, they lack my they lack me. <laughs> That's one of the <laughs> some of their strategies. We all can win on treasure hunt, guys. <laughs> yeah, man. That's the that's the upland strategy. Yeah. But it's it's oh. kind of fun, man. It's like you can feel the you can feel the tension. <laughs> yeah, you okay, can you try again. Yeah. Only get five minutes. L. Below one, right? L B yeah. here. LVD is cheap. It's a dude that spelled his own house in the wrong, wrong, wrong spelling. <laughs> B L V D R E. Let's see what's going on here. TikTok land. Let's see the street. Okay, so he's selling a house, right? Okay. So for participating today, I'm gonna do something crazy or so. I'll, I'll just drop me an offer even without even checking whether it's like near anywhere or any whatever, right? Oh yeah. damn. Yeah, man. What is the price for 39k? I'll just offer you 35k, man. And if you if if TikTok land buys this thing, right? I mean, if he accepts the offer, if I can buy it from him, I'll immediately put it up for A to Z. How's that? At a lower price that I bought it from. Immediately. Nice. <laughs> Are you going crazy right now in the live? Yeah, that that's how we do Meta Monday, man. That's how we go crazy <laughs> together, right? Yeah. We go crazy. So it's up to TikTok land whether he wants to accept this, right? That's the way. Okay, how about another round of treasure hunt, Danny? Yeah, sure, <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> let's do it, man. Let's do it together as a team, man. Yeah. Getting crazier and crazier now. Yeah, man. Let's spend another hundred and twenty-five like this. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Okay, let's do it. Okay, straight away. It's right in, man. Right in for the damn thing. Let's go. Okay, okay, okay. Come on. First, you open up the first area. Oh shit, shit. Not minted. Where am I? Where am I? Okay, wait. It needs to. It's the treasure, treasure. Okay. Where's the arrow? Diagonal, bottom right, right. Bottom right. This is, wow, this is very slow blinking. This is super far away. Oh shit. Where's my squirrel? Oh shit. Where am I? Where am I? Crap. Okay, wait. Uh, why is my map is tilted? Okay. Okay, bottom right. Okay, let's see how I'll do it. He may be here. There's so many here, right? So I'll just pick a random one. Send it here. Okay. So it's definitely not, it's definitely on this side of the map, right side of the map. Okay, let's see. Okay. Okay, blinks a little bit more, right? Blinks a little bit more than just now. So probably, yeah, probably it's between the area and here maybe i don't know we just find one jefferson park or something okay send here pretty addictive though like you can just keep doing this for hours yeah it, it gives you adrenaline like, yeah you know, and, it's just like so, you're, so yeah so focus on it you try to you try to understand that okay you know where not to click where to click okay up and it's blinking more up. one blinking at a higher frequency more. okay yeah, so it's not too left also, right? Okay, so it's over here. Okay, so, I mean, let's try this. Okay, I guess that's oh. another five dollars off. <laughs> five dollars off. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Send your squirrel. I've got three minutes, two minutes down. Hopefully, I get something that is great. Once it's great, then it are like way very close. Oh, it's blinking. Okay, it's blinking quite a bit. Blinking quite a bit. So it's probably above a little bit more. Okay, but I can't go to left side, right? So it should be over here. Okay, let's just try the green one. Somebody's selling this for like ten million dollars. Okay, Pisces boy, <laughs> username. <laughs> Two minutes and thirty seconds. I am halfway down, and I am closer than just now. I think. Okay, it's blinking quite a bit. It's blinking even more. Yep. Yeah, so I think it should be... Just now it was here, right? Ask me here. So I think it should be this area. Okay, maybe i try this. Um, 
Yeah, maybe I try this. Save one send. If it's pointing upwards, means it's in that region above the Korean town. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, go by that logic. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Click on it. Something. Ah, oh, okay. Blinking much more, right? Yeah, so I think it's here. Really. It should be in this in this pyramid, <laughs> in this triangle here. Because I was from here, right? Yeah. yeah. So it's around yeah. here. Shit. Okay, so it may be in Korea Town, really. It may be in Korea Town. Okay, let's see. Just click on one random one. Come on, open up the map. Send. Quick, 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 squirrel. Move faster. One minute. I got one minute. Zoom in. Come on. Zoom quicker, please. There you go. Okay, so it should be around here already. It's this right. this area. Send. Yeah, you know somehow I think it's a bit easier to do it on the mobile. Oh really? <laughs> yeah, somehow I, I, the, the, the feeling is a bit different. Yeah, like the, oh. the zoom and everything. Yeah, the zoom is a bit easier for me. Yeah. Left side. Yeah, over here. Come on, man. Give me some. Give me some hints, man. I'm gonna spend one more. I may not have any more cents. I got two more only. Oh shit! This is the last bet, really. This is the last bet. And then I need to go and refill my cents. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Come on. Come on, okay, come on. Oh my god, it's red there. Eh. Daddy is red. Look it's at this. Red. Shit. It's always right at the end. Shit, it may be this one. Okay, wait. Okay, <laughs> let's just this is the final one already. Okay. Jesus Christ, man, wherever you are. <laughs> Back eight seconds. Freak. Five seconds. Ah! <laughs> it's, no, it's, it's so ah! close. <laughs> is that loading? Okay, I, oh, oh. I can't, man. On. Oh shit. Damn it. See this? <laughs> it's, it's like super close already. It's ah. always close at the end. Why is it always close at the end? I'm frustrated. <laughs> oh, <it's again. laughs> well, you know, yeah. But anyway, so the yeah, the 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 redder the, the button, the more it vibrates, right? Yeah, then it's really close already. Yeah, so I guess that's that's how life is over here. Oh my god. Wow, I think the adrenaline is like, you know. Go for exercise. It's like it's doing exercise. Yeah. <laughs> so back to this cat. Oh, okay. yeah. I gotta I gotta find the the sense. Okay, shall we do another pitch of property in the meantime? But before that, let me lower the price down again. Remember, we're gonna share the pie today, right? From A to Z. Nice. Right. Anyway, if anyone wants to be as insane as me and take part in A to Z, but you must be prepared. Your property sells for zero dollars or one dollar. Right, you can let me know, you can let Danny know, right? We'll arrange for you to be on the live or so, but you can do this together with us and go crazy. Yeah, but you must be mentally prepared that it may go to like really five dollars and you lose your investment. Right. For us, we right. we don't mind. You know, we share the we share the pie. Hopefully everybody gets more of these houses, right? It's good for everyone. Anyway, I own a few houses, right? So I can sell a few, so no worries. <laughs> In case you're worried about me. Yeah. So just not finished. Let's do 23. And shall we do one pitch of property session, Danny? Any other oh. pitch of property? From Tarim Slima, 10 261 Kill Avenue. Oh, did someone just buy this? Oh, no, that was uh, another property that I was selling. Yeah, I sold for $22. You see, all these are the oh. sold property. Whoa, over the past few days. Okay, come, let's go. Which one? 10261 Kill Avenue. Where's this place? Really? I don't know. Hill Rainy. Yeah, where's this place? I need to know. So it's easier. Is it in LA? Is it in LA? For Tarin, right? Tarin. 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 Okay, good. Is this your friend? <laughs> I don't know. No. Okay, so Tarin. Yeah. Tarin. Yeah. I mean, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, what you gotta, you gotta sell the property, man. It's not for sale. <laughs> you gotta make it green. It's not for sale. How do I know what you want to sell it at, right? Yeah, but anyway. So it's not for sale. Yeah, it's not for sale, man. I mean, you gotta, you gotta sell it. You know, I'll offer you like one one UPX for you or something. You know, I'll offer you one UPX. <laughs> Where am I? Yeah. <laughs> offer you one UPX. 
Yeah, you're gonna make it for sale, right, Tarin? If not, nobody knows how much you're gonna sell it for. Yeah. Okay, I'm short on cents now. Yeah, so I need to I need to go and pick that little paper aeroplane. Yeah, see I got zero. I got zero left. Oh my goodness. Oh shit, when zero is usually quite bad because you have to send your squirrel somewhere to get. I mean your BE somewhere to get the, the sense anyway. So if you got zero sense, I don't know how you're gonna how am I gonna do that now? <laughs> Let me try to figure out. Yeah. Two zero one five North Broadway, no problem. I remember when we did the when L when there was an LA drop, right? Then everybody just panicked. So we just send a B everywhere. End up there's a lot of people that totally use up all their sense. <laughs> and then we're stuck. Yeah, we're just stuck in somewhere. We can't we can't move after that. That was quite that was quite embarrassing and insane. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is there any more? Oh crap. So there's one here. But my squirrel is quite yeah, so I'm gonna teach you guys how to change directions. <laughs> because I need my squirrel to be walking upwards, right? For me to collect this one. Yeah, so I need to just keep sending my squirrel back for free to my own place. And then hopefully the squirrel walks upwards. Yeah, this is how we do it. Let's see, hopefully he walks upwards. Is he walking upwards? No, he's walking diagonally right. Right? Yeah, bad squirrel. I need to train you. Keep sending back. Oh. Yeah. Hey, is this like a good location or something? Oh, it's a perch now. Yeah, yeah, correct, correct. Okay, that's great, that's great. Yeah, so we just let him slowly walk upwards until I reach this one. And then I'll pick this paper aeroplane up. Yeah. Okay, do we have any more uh, pitch of property today? Oh, we got a lot of pitch of properties. We got oh, a lot, of, lot of pitch of property. Tea. Nice, man. How about the low ball junk? <laughs> the low ball junk. Okay, we got four five zero three six Theme Street. It's a church at Detroit. Church at Detroit for sale. Wow. Four five zero three. I'm fine also. Okay. Once again. Okay, let's see. Uh, let me zoom out the whole map. Is there anyone that know any way how to solve the problem of not being able to find the property? Or is it an upland issue? Yeah, oh, because I... that's why. I... Yeah, I mean, like you see, I, I was, I, I, I try to get around the problem by zooming out, going into the city, and then hopefully I can find it if I'm like that. I don't know whether it works. Yeah. Four. Okay. Four five zero three. Sixteenth Street. <clears throat> Street. Okay. Let's see. I'm not too into churches, man, because I, I can't understand the tangible value of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But let's see what's around, whether it's in any collection or it's not any collection. No. Yeah. Okay, so how did how did this uh community member pitch the property? Or is it just spamming the thing there, Danny? Is it spam? Yeah, he did spam. He spam. It's spam, man. For that, I'll give you a low ball offer. <laughs> I'll give you a low ball offer for not pitching your property. Oh, I can't even give a low ball offer. <laughs> you can't? Oh, no. Yeah, man. You got to open it for a low ball offer. Christian. Okay, next. Okay, next. Yeah. We got... Next, next. Yeah, let's give more opportunity for people to feature their property as well. Yeah, in case you want to church, you can you can buy the, the property that we just saw just now. 218 at... What, what's this? What, J, what, what's JFC though? I need no KFC. Nice chicken. Yay, I picked up four cents. Now my squirrel can go anywhere. GFC, GFC, many sticks. GFC. Okay, I can get more sense in the meantime. I need more paper planes. Come on, man. Paper planes can you appear? Show me the paper planes. Show me the money. Show, Show me the money. Show me the money. Oh, I got one more here. That's great. Well, wow, this is a daily this is the daily upland grind, man. To whoever that plays upland, right? This is probably what you do also. Yeah. <laughs> Search for paper planes, do treasure hunt, try to flip your property, try to look for you know idiots like Leon that's trying to sell it at a cheap price. <laughs> that's what you probably <laughs> Yeah, that's what you probably do is a daily grind, right? And then you make money yeah. off this thing, right? And then you tell your friends like, hey, I make money off NFT, and they're like, you scam. <laughs> you scam. 
<laughs> yeah. What's this game? What is this game? <laughs> yeah, like, oh, you can make money, it's a scam. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, one second. Let me just pick up the sand. It's okay. Okay, wow, there's so many of these sands around this place. Okay, I'm just gonna like be cheap and take everything, right? Since since I'm here. See, I'm donating money to all these people, you know. <laughs> 25 UPX. Okay, if anyone's in LA, right, drop your, your property in the comments or you can set it to the max UPS up, up to you, right? I'll just drop my squirrel. I'll say hi to you. You can get a free UPX or so. If you turn up for the live, I think you deserve some free uh, some free UPX from me or so, right? right? So if you're in LA, you don't feel like selling a property, but you want Leon to visit you, right? Just type in your, your address there and say, visit me right now, okay? Then we'll just send my squirrel there. Yeah. That's just so yeah, it's, we're going crazy with the this Meta Monday thing, man. And it's thick. Detroit again. See, Danny, something is going on in Detroit, man. <laughs> yeah, Detroit. Why, Why do man? people keep selling Detroit? <laughs> yeah, is it a pump and dumps? Some, you know? This one, Stretch. What? Why is his name so weird? Stretch. <laughs> If you can if you can pronounce this name, I'll give you some UPX, man. Stretch. <laughs> I think stretch gang. Is that what he's trying to do? Stretch gang. Stretch gang. It's like A, but you look cool, so you like flip the A the other way around, right? Like I want, right. I want to go non-mainstream, so I stretch gang. Yeah, what's what's this person's name though on Facebook? Yeah. His name is Teriri Kawiti. I don't know. Oh, okay. I'll stick to stretch again. It's much easier to pronounce. <laughs> stretch gang. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is much easier to pronounce. Okay, so stretch gang is a is a new player, right? You see, he's he's hundred. He just crossed the pole only from uplander to pole. Yeah. So as usual, we like to help uh people who have just started out, right? Right. Yeah. Okay. Let's have a look here, and it's Showing part of this yellow. This this uh purple collection, right? Let's make some offer. Oh, you probably got lucky if you if you got this collection, right? Let's see mm. something. Oh man, you. Oh no. Oh man, yeah. you can't make the offer, man. You see, dude, you gotta. I think you lost a chance to be featured, man. You gotta put it flexible, man. We gotta, you know, you gotta go back and forth to negotiate. Yeah. So you gotta put this. Yeah, always be open minded, right? Or I always say, if you are looking for a deal, right, always be open minded. You never know. Maybe you see there's a random Leon that comes in and offer you twenty two k. I think you'll take it, right? Uh, good deal, right? Yeah, that's a good deal. Okay, yeah. then. so next. Next one, come on. Let's give more people the chance. What's next? Two, two, three, seven, seventeen, Victory Boulevard. Victory Boulevard. That sounds very familiar. California. Okay, what's this username? Pitch a property. Anyway, it's a good chance to get featured, right? Yeah, I can yeah. see. Musashi. This guy sounds familiar. Yeah, I think I we, think yeah, it came before, right? Musashi. Yeah, yeah. Musashi came before. Musashi came before, find, right? Yeah. I can't find he, their username. Oh, welcome to McDonald's. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. Ooh, I'm loving it too. <laughs> yeah. I'm hungry now. Yeah. McDonald's. 23717 Victory Boulevard. Okay, we do the usual grind. Two three seven one seven victory. Boulevard. Oh, I see Pizza Hut. What? Outdoor living. It's Pizza Hut here. Yeah, not bad, not bad, not bad. But you know, I'm not gonna pay you so much for this property, right? Because I think it's trying to make double the the UPX on me, right? Musashi, that's very that's very nasty of you. You're trying to make double the UPX on me. That's bad, man. That's bad negotiation, man. <laughs> right. And considering the fact that we actually bought some stuff from you before, that's bad. Right? Let me see whether you have learned the art of negotiation by seeing how much of an offer you can allow also. Oh, not bad, you see? Then he has learned from the master. Oh. Yes, <laughs> he has learned. <laughs> yes. He has learned to be flexible, man. Ah, that's great. So I shall not abuse Ooh. his uh, learning and offer him 20,000 or something, right? <laughs> yeah. No, but it's not bad. I mean, if you are looking for... Uh, if you're looking for some fast food restaurant over here, why not, right? You can get some McDonald's, but it's quite far. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And oh, you can, see, you can see the logo. 
Yeah, you can see the logo, right? Yeah, it's quite far. You can zoom in at like it. <laughs> and I mean, for the community, if you want, you can consider. It's you know, it can be part of your CT Pro collection as well. Why not? Yeah, but this junk is not for me. It's too expensive. Nobody sells their junk for double, man. Just like that, right? Okay, so thanks. Yeah. Yep. Next. Okay. Bye bye. So, this is from Ash Nice. <laughs> I like the bye bye. Seven eight three zero. Seven eight okay, three zero. Super Academy. Before that, let's bump that 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 property lower even man option to zero. Right. Remember. Let's just keep bumping lower and lower. Let's go crazy. All right. Yeah. The A to Z property, guys. You got A to Z exactly. You gotta go to five. 280 and Sherman Avenue. Oh my goodness, it's gonna be $18. $62 selling for $18. If you're on the live right now and you're not buying this, right? You know, I don't I would I would I would change the game name to downland or something instead of upland. Yeah. Just yeah, just buy it, guys. It says like 62 to $18. I'll hand it <laughs> to you, man. <laughs> Like there's a guy that came to me, right? He said that shit, you know, like you sold the other thing at 22. The, the, the price that we bought is the market price about 50 or 70. So I just put it mm. to 22. Oh. Then he's like, ah, yeah. And then I think he's probably watching the live now. But anyway. <laughs> okay, see, what? Wow, many things to do. 7830 uh, Shubrick Avenue. Avenue or street? Avenue? Okay, let's see. I can't find the avenue, so I'll just go to the street first. <clears throat> <laughs> is it this one? Avenue? Yep, it's a, yep, that's the one. Ralph Wiggum. Oh, Ralph Wiggum. Hi, Ralph Wiggum. Okay, this one is too much of a high ball. Okay, wait, I'll explain to everybody why. Oh, what's this? Like Shelly or something? <laughs> New Orleans. New Orleans, okay. Okay, all this FSA, 50,000, 6,000. Okay, this one actually, right, if you do it properly, this can be a very good, uh, can be a good note. Okay, I'll share with everyone why. I'll just give you all some ideas, right? There's a river here, right? I suppose there's some river or there's some water. Yeah. Oh, it looks weird. Okay. It's a stream or it something, right? Yeah. Like yeah. a bong. Yeah. Or a so, pepper shaker. Yeah. Then usually we try to find places that are underpopulated, right? Okay, this one is a bit overpopulated, right? Try to find some place underpopulated and it must have some good looking location. Like it's easy for people to find. Like, you know, the lazy ranch, right? It's just there, right? There's a park and then like, everybody's around there. So it's very easy to find. Then Broadway is the entire street of Broadway. Very easy to find. Yeah, so I think this one is also quite easy to find because there's, you can tell people next to a stream, right? That is connecting to a big river over here. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, little bit. So probably it's quite okay that if you want, you can develop it into a node or something. Give some incentive for the people that are coming anyway. Yeah, and then that's good. Right? But I don't buy overpriced junk. <laughs> so next. <laughs> next. Okay, yeah. bye bye. Bye bye. Oh, yeah. So someone asks if the uh, 5280 Sherman Avenue is available in UPX. Oh, Joanne asks is it available in UPX? It's available in USD. That's that's the whole fun of the game. All oh, right, USD guys, USD. Yeah, that's the whole that's the whole fun of the game, man. We gotta deal with thing, a piece of junk in Kansas City. Okay, I love Kansas. All right. Okay, this this junk is from Henry. Uh, a piece of junk, five two zero four Chestnut Avenue, Kansas City. Yeah, four two zero four Kansas City. Let's see what is going on. Ooh, there's a house, man. Upland HJT. Oh, if I'm not wrong, I think Upland HJT, HJT participated in one of our stuff before, right? I think it's yesterday, in our last live. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Okay. That's nice. For taking part again, I shall offer you something just for the heck of it. Right? Let's see who can lowball each other better. If you sell me at forty thousand, I'll buy it and I'll put it up for sale immediately for like thirty USD. How's that? <laughs> yeah, we can do a we can do a great deal together. 
Yeah. Forty thousand USD. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, come on, ladies and gentlemen, pitch me your properties, man. Give me some good stuff. You see, I got nine hundred thousand. I got almost a million UPX, man. Ready to buy some stuff. I need some good junk. Give me some good junk, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Any more, Danny? There's a lot more. There's a lot more. Okay, I think we'll probably do two more, and okay, we'll do two more, and then I'll lower the price of the thing if it's still not sold, and then we call it a day, man. That's a good one. We call it. Yeah. East. Chester. Oh, Bronx. Wow, it's in the Bronx, man. The fucking Bronx, mate. Let's see. Let's see what's going on, man. Symphony Squirrels. Just collected the passive income. East two four one four, Indra one two one two. Hey, all these are very familiar accounts. Yeah. Yeah, those very think... familiar accounts. Right. Street. Let's see what we have over here. Oh my god, this looks a bit scary. <laughs> this looks really quite. I I don't know, man. I think what's this? Some Halloween thing. I think it's what's this on Halloween. Oh my goodness. I'm out of here, man. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> they sell me some spooky shit, guys. Oh, there's some supplements. Oh, you want to eat some supplements? GNC. Get some pharmacy over here. <clears throat> See this. Parking for professionals in the garage. Gar garage. Yeah, it's, it's too spooky, man. I ain't no buying spooky stuff today, man. <laughs> yeah. Okay, next. Any others? Okay, the next. Oh, this one comes with a message. I want okay. to invite you to our node. Is it my junk? 3610 NE, Northeast, 48th wow. Street, Kansas City. That's great, guys. You got you to pitch it like him, man. I mean, it's not so much of a pitch, but you got to pitch it. Like, tell, tell us, tell everybody on the live, right? Why is your property worth buying, right? What's NE, Northeast? Yeah. 48th Street. Yeah, I see something. But what did it? Oh, okay, here. Let's see, man. Let's see. Oh, there's a note here. Okay, let's explore together, right? See what what's cool about the note. Why not you share? With, why not you share with the community what's what's cool about your note, man? Yeah, at least we know, right? Whoever this user is, can't see. Can you see Facebook user? Uh, hot pro manado. Oh, oh he, okay. He joined oh, our okay. last live too. Yeah, nice. Oh, so it's a it's a it's a node in this area. So what's the benefit of this node? Oh, am I seeing the correct one? Three six one zero, right? Some overpriced stuff. Yeah, I think I can consider, but you have to let me know what's in it for for anyone that joins the note, right? Uh, not just for me. I think for everyone that's committed, you can you can use this chance to shield some of your properties anyway, right? Buy some of the people one. You can sell your, your thing. Yeah. For now, it's really junk because you haven't told me why it's good yet. Yeah. Okay. Any more from the the, the noobs? Okay. Any way to understand who is the noobs? Like, if you have anything that it's, if you have just crossed the hundred thousand UPX, I really want to help you to get started out, right? So just. Pitch your property, man. Pitch your property. Yeah. Okay, let's do okay. one more. Let's do one more. Uh, property. Then I will... I'll keep lowering the price. I'll keep lowering the price. Let's go crazy. I'll keep lowering the price. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, if you haven't sniped this property yet, it's going for $18. $18 oh. only. Oh, oh as nice. As nice as uh, want you to visit her property like two three six nine three posy in la oh hey, i think someone someone bought it someone Ooh, bought it oh nice yeah, for luke. <laughs> congratulations luke? luke you got a steal of a lifetime you see this you see the real legends he has a nineteen thousand network net worth right nineteen thousand usd net worth oh see, uh, that's how you luke, become nineteen thousand in the facebook live Yes. If you're in the Facebook Live, please shout your name out. Shout your name out, man. Yeah. And then I would like to congratulate you for being a very, very smart shopper. 
<laughs> who's buying something that is sixty something thousand that is only you bought it for eighteen dollars and that's how you become nineteen thousand dollars worth of net worth. That's life, man. You see, that's how a smart that's shopper amazing. reacts, right? Wow, I'm very, I'm very uh, intrigued. I thought probably like a, a, a you know, a, a just someone who just is like a noob will buy, but it's not. You see, someone who has nineteen thousand dollars worth of net worth. <laughs> yeah so congrats luke for getting a very very good deal for yourself right and as promised okay so tiktok land is he he just he just sold me the property right for thirty five thousand. just now i was buying right danny yeah so he accepted so i'm going to see whether i can put it on sale right now or i can't oh i can't i gotta uh, hold it for okay. two days more but it's okay i mean i can put it for like you know i can lowball myself and put it for you it's like thirty two thousand. <laughs> I bought it for 35, I'll sell it for 32. I think that's how they go crazy together. I'm going to spoil the economy for everyone, right? But that's the benefit of following our community. Yeah. You See, get first-hand info, you got hot yeah. deals, and you only can get it in our community, in Upland Pros and the NFT culture, guys. Yeah, man. Buying for 35k and selling it for 32k. <laughs> Where else? Where else? Where else can you get such good deals? Okay, this one is in Detroit again. Oh my god, guys, come on, man. What's with the Detroit Sorry. syndrome? You guys got Detroit syndrome, man. Bring me some LA properties, man. What, Actually, what's I have Detroit? one. Oh, really? I, I okay, have let's one. Go to LA. LA. Come on. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, I'm switching, but I can't find it. He or she. Yeah, go LA, man. I happen to be in LA right now, so that's great. Also, ask nice. Uh, wants you to visit her property in LA too. Sure, come on, bring it on, man. Hey, Danny, this name looks familiar. <laughs> Matoneg. Okay, he has come again. Yeah, man. Hey, give some chance to the newbies, man. Okay, but let's have a look, right? I I will help you to show your property, right? Since you take part in this, okay? This is a very very nice looking uh like a bungalow thing, right? You see, you can fit two cars over here. Right over the back, you have this. How many five stories? Right, so if you're feeling rich, you can buy one and you get one free, right? And you cover the staircase in green, so you look like a, I don't know, like some grass or something. Yeah, and the name is quite nice. It's like Vantage, yeah? Vantage. Like the core. Like a, like, a, like a Vantage. And then you've got some buildings over here. You never know. This may be some cool stuff that is going to happen. Yeah. Matong Deng. Okay, but anyway, since you're here, right, I'll drop you this. I will send you... A visit right and you can get 325 UPX just for taking part in pitch of property if you're in LA now. There you go. Okay, I'm at I'm at his house. You see, and he gets free UPX from me. There you go. See my superior screen here. Yeah. See, that's how we do it on live. You can get free UPX from Dion. Oh, see, he purposely set the price higher just to get me to pay more money. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah, yeah okay. I, that, uh, I mean, okay, fine, fine. That's for tuning in, not bad, not bad. You get some good stuff, right? That's life. Okay, any more? Come on. Visit me, please. Yeah, Ash. 60. Nice. 60. Ash. Ash. If the name is Ash. Yeah, her name is Ash. Ash. Oh. Ash Cat. Oh, no. Wait, no. He's a guy. I'm sorry, Ash. I'm sorry, that's oh, my bad. Oh, man. It's okay, man. Ash, Ash Ketchum, man. What's your favorite Pokemon, right? Two, nine, two, the Ash grew up, I think, two, three, nine, six, nine, three. OZ in. P O S E Y. OZ lane. OZ. Okay. Oh. That's like so near. That's, that's, that's so near the. That's so near the. the it, is it in the LRP? <laughs> I think it may be near the LRP. Yeah, is it is it near the LRP? Okay, it even is. better, right? So you're part of our note. All the more I'll visit you, right? Okay, come on. Let's, let's do it. Yeah, well, that's life, man. Ralph Wiggum. 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 This, this. Oh, are you sure his name is Ash? His name is Ralph here. <laughs> 23693, right? Okay, I'll visit you. Yeah, okay, come on. I mean, if you, you're kind of me, you don't want to set the UPX visit to like 150 or something, right? Oh, I'll visit you. Yeah, let's give it, give it to you, man. Every week, every Monday, Meta Monday is a Santa Claus day, man. You get some stuff. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and the final one for this, I'll tell you what, I'll put one more property up, uh, the house one up, and then A to Z, and then we 
we'll see how it goes off the life right danny right let's do it let's do yeah, it sell one more man i got one more here some people that that's watching is now regretting that they uh, didn't snatch the sherman sherman app is a property and now this is your chance guys exactly man this is your chance so you see i'm selling for 65 i'm not bullshitting right like all these are prices that i usually put in the market right so i bought it for 59 dollars right and i try to sell it for 65 make a small profit right yeah but now we're going to do it the other way around again i bought it for 59 i'm going to sell it for 48 and we start the ball rolling from here oh man <laughs> snack your property man and you know it's they they're just saying that it's not how high you sell it's you make profits when you actually buy because you buy at the right price you can sell it at any price yeah okay so 6350 north fourth street in fresno go snag it go snag it right okay great is that all danny for today actually uh someone told us this is my new offer 49k i think it's the new this is christian the guy from sherman oaks Sherman Oaks collection. It is, I think that's in LA. I can drop you a visit. Let's see here. Let's do one final visit. Rand okay. Drive. One final one. One final of the final one. Ladies and gentlemen, can't be too center classy every day. If not, next time you open yeah. my account, the UPX will be zero. <laughs> yeah, sometimes the comments are very slow. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Sherman Oaks collection, right? I probably haven't even filled up my Sherman Oaks collection. Well, let's see, right? What do you have here? Wow, look at this. Woo. Oh, that's nice. Woo. Yeah, we got some trees over here. Some nice house. Right? Okay, I would like always like to check the neighboring prices. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I'll do one deal with you. Okay, let's do some uh let's do some negotiation. Before that, let me see who you are. Who are you? Oh, this guy is not a noob. He's trying to get to, I think, the director status or something, the $1 million mark. Oh, right? Okay. Yeah, so I, I, I have to do some hardball to, to toughen you up as you level up, right? 5k for this. See how it goes? Yeah. Nice, nice. 5k? Okay. okay. Most probably, I think he will accept because it's a very, very great deal. He's making... Um, he or she is making 3x of the, the initial money that you, you invested over here. Yeah. Okay, great. I think we can call it a day, Danny. I think it's great. Yeah, we're calling it a day. And thank you guys for tuning in uh, th this week in Meta Monday, brought to you by Symphony Scroll, a music-loving and supportive community in the NFT space, specially built to support musicians from all around the world. Uh, Symphony Scrolls have 130 uh music nfts on ethereum and it's now readily available on OpenSea. and and they uh the symphony scrolls community have a lot of great utilities for example the exclusive symphony scrolls orchestra club uh, you you guys will have access to their exclusive club in the in the discord server and get all the hot news and all the the alpha info and we'll probably play upland together and just scale together and also, uh, the one most interesting utility that Symphony Scrolls give you is if you hold uh, a Symphony Scroll that you you buy at first hand from uh, the Symphony Scrolls creators, you will receive a passive income of ten million uh, uh, million music tokens that is supported million. by the, the ten million. It is supported by the NFT Music AI uh, a coin that supports musicians around the world and you will be given 10 million music coins for every 0 0.1 ETH you spend for the first direct purchase so huddle and earn and you can also elevate your game in upland by buying a scroll and just holding it get that money 10 million music money and when you get uh, enough money you go back to upland and invest that money from symphony scrolls to upland and you just get a lot of money streams and it just goes around in circles and this is why it's, and symphony scrolls uh the community will also help you and music nfts are trending now it's booming guys so this is your chance and again 
thank you for tuning in and to Meta Monday. I'll see you guys next week. See you guys. See you guys. Bye-bye. Bye.